solar eclipses. See the figure which shows a solar eclipse. It shows the shadow of the moon falling on the earth when it comes between the earth and the sun. The shadow is of two types. In some part it is dense while in other parts it is sparse. The dense shadow is called umbra and the sparse shadow is called penumbra. From the region of the earth which comes under the dark shadow or umbra, the sun becomes invisible. Such a situation is called total solar eclipse. From the region of the penumbra, the sun appears to have been partially covered. This is called partial solar eclipse. Total solar eclipse is seen from a highly restricted area though the situation may occur frequently. However, a partial eclipse can be observed at the same time from the region under penumbra. The region from which a total solar eclipse can be seen is shown by A in the figure, B in the figure indicates the region from which partial solar eclipse can be seen. Note that from the region marked as C, the solar eclipse is not visible. At times, when the moon is too far from the earth, that is, in apogee position, the shadow of the moon does not reach the earth and ends up in the space itself. Under such a situation, an edge of the sun disk remains visible. It appears like a ring. Hence it is called annular solar eclipse. However, an annular solar eclipse is a rare event. 